let's start things off with an oldie but a goodie. You all know the song. You can either dance to it or sing along because I know you all know it. Producer Rio, aka Supercell. Well, what the heck was that song about? Well, quite obviously, it's about some spoiled girl trying to force her feelings onto a guy she just so happens to like, and he, she wants to mold him into her perfect prince so they can live happily ever after. Although in real life, it's just I'm gonna mold this guy into my perfect boyfriend, which. 
Some might say, oh, okay, it's not that bad that she wants to mold him into her perfect mate, but it kind of is because, well, at the end of the day, you're trying to change someone. Um, since this is one of the most early popular Vocaloid songs, you can admire all the work that goes into it, the mixing, obviously the music in the background, heck, even the promotional video, but you can also agree that compared to a lot of the songs that have come out since, this song can be seen as somewhat dated. Not that it's a bad thing, but the technology has gotten better. And also, World Is Mine is one of those Vocaloid songs that is constantly remixed, constantly resung, constantly covered. I think almost every Vocaloid has done a cover of this song. I have to go back and check, but it's one of those top five constantly redone songs. There's four more and... Uh, Discerning through all of those is gonna be fun, <laughs> but no, um, it's it's a good song. I will not deny that it's not a good song. It's not one of my favorites, but it is a good song, and I really like the artwork in this promotional video. This promotional video compared to some of the other ones, because some of the other ones just seem too bland and static for my taste, unless it's literally a pro a Project Diva level or a Miku Miku dance video. I just like the attention to detail, like Miku's nails, her different outfits, her princess outfit. Oh, and my favorite part of the song has to be the part with the pudding and the strawberry shortcake. I just like the bouncy rhythm that it gets there. So, yeah. World is Mine, not one of my personal favorites, but I do appreciate what this song did for Vocaloid's popularity and Miku's popularity. At, at every live concert show that Miku does, this song is sung first. From what I've seen, of videos, this song is always, uh, she always sings first. Though, if you want a real experience with this song, see it in concert. The mixing that they do for the concert, as well as her dancing, make the experience all the more worthwhile. So, that was the beginning of Vocaloid Month with World Is Mine. Hope to see you all tomorrow.